and he just feed it the one billing us, right? Yeah, Are so. Going to pay us for that? Yeah, yeah, and so if you are on the, the solar rate, you should see that on your PG&E bill as like a credit from us. So any oh, excess mm -hmm, oh, energy that you so produce. Your name or whatever that is, uh, Peninsula, is on the bill. Yeah. That you are mm -hmm. yeah, giving out credits for extra or surplus energy. Yeah, okay. yeah, that's how so, you. Mm -hmm. yeah. Only if you own your solar system. Yeah, if you have your own solar panel. But if you have your solar panel, but you didn't pay for the total price of it. If you own or if you lease. Lease, if you lease. Yes, I'm not. It. You have only the rate if you own that panel. Yeah, I guess. This is a solar panel. Put on the solar system. Yeah, if you have any specific questions, I think it depends on what the program in is and how you know the benefits are are distributed. We can yeah talk about that, but I yeah. Yeah, I think it, depending on how it's structured, you might see the credit in different ways. And so, yeah, if you have like your PG&E bill, you can email that to me and, and we can show you where that credit is. But I think, yeah, depending on, on the program, I, I can't say definitively how it would show up on your bill if you lease your, your solar panels. Yeah, well, my question, question is uh, generally, if uh, you you know if uh, you didn't purchase fully pay your you know your pa panel mm -hmm. panels means you are not entitled for for the rebate. But if you fully purchase it, then you are entitled to the rebate. I think even if you do lease your your panels, you you can get a credit. But I'm I think it also depends on the leasing structure. So I yeah can't say for sure, but I do know it is possible. But under some circumstances, if you lease the solar panel, that you could get the bill savings directly. But it sounds like your program doesn't allow you to do that. So okay. you, the way it works, if you lease your solar, mm -hmm. you're not going to get any credit from <coughs> taxation. Oh, sorry. Unless oh. you purchase it. If it's a lease, the provider or the people that sold it will get the credit for it. Oh, I see. So I so think it's better to buy it if you can if you can afford it. It's a very expensive endeavor. Yeah. I, so I think maybe I was talking about something different. It sounds like what you all are referring is to tax credits for for leasing your. I was talking about tax credit. This tax I credit. Just, uh, reinforce what he just said. Yeah. Yeah. If you. Yeah. For tax credits, I. I, I don't think that you would be able to get a tax credit for if you lease your system, right. but I was yeah referring to the credit on your PG&E PG bill PG. for generating excess energy. Same so. thing with the you won't have any credit if you don't own solar panels. Yeah, for if you lease it, you don't have <coughs> on your yeah on your tax you bill. Mm -hmm. What's your experience on a private home that has solar? Have they really given uh, a surplus to you? So the to the, to the uh, peninsula, peninsula clean energy. Yeah. So is your question if if you have a solar system and you're producing more energy than you use, will Peninsula Clean Energy buy that extra solar from you? Is that your question? Yeah. Mm -hmm. so have, have have they been selling it to you? The the extra, yes, yes. The yeah, so we yeah, we will purchase the extra extra solar from you at a rate that's actually higher than what PG and E would pay you. You say so. we will, but has it already oh, yes. been? Yeah. But it's just a credit on your bill. Yeah, so it's no, a no money. It's they a won't, you won't see any cent. So it's it will a will be only on your bill. It will be credited to you. Yeah, so yeah. it will deduct from the other charges on your bill. Yeah. And then if you have, you know, ev every year, if you have, I think, over $100 in credit, you'll get a, a check in the mail. But if it's less than $100 at that point, then you'll just see it as a deduction on your bill to so that you don't have to, yeah, it'll credit you against some of the other charges. So yeah. the, um, the extra power produced by our solar panels, mm -hmm. Goes back to PGD grid, correct? 
goes back to the beginning with, I always thought they are consolidated by PGA only. It's only now that I realize that there are other players, and one is Peninsula. Um, Peninsula Clean Energy. And one is Peninsula Clean Energy. So you, you consolidate them and sell it back to the customers through rebates or to, through tax credits. So is your question about the... My question, is, my question is, where do those uh, extra uh, uh, electric, electricity goes to? Mm -hmm. who, who consolidates them? Who claims them? Who um, owns them? Yeah, so it, it goes back on, on, the, on the grid, the electricity grid. And so Peninsula Clean Energy will credit you for the extra energy that you're producing. Not the so, union, or is it an option? I think. Do we option to have PGND take care of it, or do we option to have an sort of clean energy take care of it? Yeah, so you could, so you're automatically signed up for Peninsula Clean Energy, but you can always opt out. So if you decide that you don't want to receive your energy from Peninsula Clean Energy, you can receive it from PGE instead, and then they'll handle you know the excess energy that you're producing. But we, we want to go with you because you said you're giving us better deal than PGE. Mm -hmm. So and, 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 and if, if the way I understand <coughs> your explanation is you're piggybacking from PG and E. Now, how do you uh, how do you how can you save how can you save uh, money from mm -hmm. from you know you're using the facilities of PG and mm -hmm. E and then coming back to you. Yeah, so I think the question is, you know, how can, I mentioned that we save our customers, it's actually 5% on energy generation. And so the question is, how can we save money, you know, compared to P if you were to receive it from PG&E? And one reason is that we're a not-for-profit